Hi, this is Freckles G. Today I'm going to show you how you can update the patch that fixes vulnerability on the SMB server on Windows XP, Service Pack 2, and Service Pack 3. Okay, first uh, let's go ahead and install Firefox web browser in case you don't have it installed yet. To do this uh, quickly, just go and click and start, run, and type http column forward slash forward slash mozilla.org and click OK. Then just uh, click on the link to download the Firefox installer. Just click on run. Then just go ahead and install in the installation process. Okay, in the Firefox, just uh, go ahead and type on the search box KB4012598 and to narrow the search just type article then Okay, we are looking for uh, the second link in this case, the one that says MS17-010, just uh, click on there, wait for the page to load. Here you, you can see the description of this security update. And we are looking for uh, the part that says Method 2 on uh, how to obtain and install the update right here. We're looking for a method 2. It says Microsoft Update Catalog. Just click on there. And here we are presented with uh, different patches for the same. A windows for say, different windows uh, versions the one we're looking for in case we have a service pack 3 32 bit or or a service pack 2 this will, will be the second option as you can see there is no service pack uh, 2 listed here in case you have a 64 bit windows xp you will need to download that one but in this case we're going to go and download the second option then just click on the link. And just save the file. Once it's saved, it will show on the arrow, the download arrow window. Just uh, click on the button right there. And then just click on the file. And then click on run. And uh, in this case, in this computer, we have a Service Pack 2 installed. So right here, we are presented with a stop that is not letting us install this due to a Service Pack 2. And it's asking for Service Pack 3. So while, uh, while we're going we're gonna, to uh, do a little trick in order to make uh, Windows think that we have Service Pack 3. And so we're allowed to, to install this update. 
So to do this, we just go ahead and just click on start, run, and type re edit, and then click OK. Right there, uh, we're presented with the registry Windows editor. So go ahead and click on H key local machine, then system, then uh, current set, control, and then right there, just scroll down to the bottom until you find the folder, the Windows folder. Just click on there. And uh, we're looking for the entry. This is the full path. And we are looking for the entry that that is called CSD version. And if you see, it has 200 as value. So we need to uh, change that to 300. Just right click on it, modify, and just change uh, 200 for uh, 300 right there. Just click OK. And right now we should be able to install this hotfix. So let's let's give it a try. Just click and then just click on run. It's right there. So just uh it's a good practice just to back up, you know, all your information before you install anything. So just... So, it has been installed successfully. So just restart your computer and we should be okay here now. Uh, on the registry, you can actually revert the 200 the 300 for 200 and, and just uh, close it you know just the same way as we did uh, the update so well thank you for watching this video i hope this was useful for you and we'll see you next time thank you goodbye